सो यूर एन आर्किटेक्ट और एन एस्पायरिंग मन बट आपको ये पता नहीं कि आपने पीसी के लिए क्या हार्डवेयर और किस बजट के लिए लेना चाहिए या कितना बजट आपको रखना चाहिए डोंट वरी डोंट वरी डोंट वरी डोंट वरी इन टूडेज वीडियो वील गो थ्रू एवरीथिंग यू नीट नो टू बिल्डिंग योर ऑटो गैट पी सी नॉट जस्ट दिस टाइम बट एनी टाइम इन द फ्यूचर so let's get started now before we get into what's the right budget we need to understand how each piece of your hardware affects your pc when you're working on autocad so there are four main components we should be worrying about cpu gpu ram and storage now coming to the cpu now autocad workflow performance depends on single core speed except for the requirements of 2d regeneration and mental re-rendering which depends on core count so high clock speed is your friend Intel 13th Gen K series is actually a brilliant option. i7, i9, whatever high core speed you want. Now coming to the GPU, it's the responsible for displaying your models. Now 2D models don't need high-end versions. Better to spend on CPU, RAM, or SSD. Now for 3D models, if you intensely work with 3D models, spend at least one third of your budget on your GPU. If you use 3D models occasionally, you can spend more on the GPU. 3D है तो GPU लेना अच्छा वाला नहीं है तो नहीं लेना मतलब ले लेना बट अच्छा वाला नहीं मतलब सस्ता वाला मतलब बजट एनी ऑटोकैट डजन यूज अ लॉर्ड ऑफ वी रैम सो बाई द जी पी यू विद मोर कोर्स एंड स्पीड अनलेस यूर यूजिंग सम रेंडरिंग सॉफ्टवेयर लाइक वी रे एंड रेंडरिंग एट रियली हाई रेजोल्यूशन द मोर वी रैम इन दोज केसेज इज मोर बेनिफिशियल क्वाड्रो सीरीज ऑफ कार्ड आर प्रेफर्ड एस्पेशली फॉर ऑफिस टाइप सेटअप बिकॉज ऑटोकैट doesn't officially support any other gpu geforce cards also work but autocad won't provide support in case of any software related bug or issue now coming to the ram ram ka ek hi cheez for ram the more you have the more parts or models can fit into one project if you're constructing an entire site plan pura community ka bana de raha then having more ram like around 64 gb plus is good but if you're just working on a single part or assemblies with less than 10 15 stuff even 8 to 16 gb kind of suffices now coming to storage now oh, here's where gets a little trick mostly it only affects your boot time and not the performance in software because your project files get loaded into the ram but in case your ram is full then the software makes a cache drive on your storage which is nothing but a folder housing commonly used file for the application so while you can get things done by just having an hdd our recommendation is a three tier storage get an nvme ssd for your os and applications get a hard drive for storing dump files and then get a separate nvme just for the cache drive don't keep any files on this yet and set this drive as the case drive in your software who samajh gaya teen cheeze leni hai do mm me hd now this way you can make sure you get the best performance even when working with a project that might look to be a little too heavy for your pc now coming to how much budget you should be spending for people who are just starting out an entry level pc of around 50000 should work about fine you can easily work with up to 10 15 different parts without having issues an ideal budget would be somewhere around 1 to 1.5 lakhs depending on the amount of 3d projects but once you've become an experienced architect For a designer working with multiple complex projects at the same time, that is when we should be looking at higher-end workstation-grade hardware like Threadripper or Xeon CPUs. But you need those extra core counts. You need that high core speeds. And if you're working in a team, it actually becomes better to make a complete network setup with unified storage, rendering palm, so that you and your teammates can access together instead of just going. for one high end pc for everyone so we actually do this for a lot of architecture firms and in case you want something like that for yourself feel free to get in touch and for individuals you can check out our catalog of optimized autocad builds here link in the description and if you want a custom pc that is made for your use case but you're not up for all the hassle of building it yourself you're already at the right place do get in touch and we'll see you until next time cheers